Hey, Joe. Yeah. Like you, I thought of making a, a little solo, a little solo review. Not a little Han, but a little solo review. Uh -huh. However, I did not because I did not feel that it was fucking worth it. And what wasn't worth it? The Blu-ray release of The Menu. I know last week I said, hey, I'll be here the 17th and talk about it, but not really it's nothing to talk about. We talked about the movie twice. It's good mm -hmm. shit. If you haven't seen it, fucking watch it. There's uh, a three or four part making of that isn't long at all, isn't interesting. They had like a fucking, man, these celebrity chefs and shit, I just don't get it. How they're fucking all dressed like fucking bohemian traveling fucking artists and shit. Like, I don't know. Like, the the food stylist in this <laughs> movie is some bitch who looks like she'd fucking hang out with people who do heroin on the back of a fucking tour bus or some shit. So that's I a real just, thing. Like they they labeled I guess, some girls dude. at a food stylist. Yeah, dude, that shit's so way above my head. I mean, you need food for nourishment. That's some lunar fucking, new you know, year bullshit. To right live. Yeah, it is. I we, fucking rabbits don't have fancy little things laid out for. They just fucking eat the grass. You know what I'm just eat. It doesn't have to be this fancy fucking an experience. Eat the fucking cheeseburger, you fuck. I just, I don't get that shit, dude. So it was just shit like that. They fucking barely even talked to the actors. Uh, Ray Fiennes had one thing I thought was funny. They were talking about the s'mores things. Like, what the fuck's a s'more? No, sorry. Oh, mate, what the fuck's, what the fuck's a s'more? Nobody outside of America knows what the fuck a s'mores is. So I was just like, ah, foreigners swearing. It always gets me. But yeah, it was, who gives a fuck? This sucks. This is, this is nothing. Rubbish for the bin. <laughs> and then there was fucking three deleted scenes. And I was like, I don't give a fuck about deleted scenes. They're deleted for a reason. Right. And that was it. Right. No commentary track, nothing else. Just that shitty behind the scenes bullshit, three deleted scenes. And, you know, I would say, oh, maybe I'm just fucking, you know, all these boutique things I get where it's loaded up with fucking special features. So you don't feel like you're getting totally robbed. But I mean, there's mainstream releases, you know, there's at least a commentary track. What, you didn't give a fuck enough to talk about your own goddamn movie? Right. Just it's something that's the easiest shit to fucking do. It's just a commentary track. You watch your fucking movie and talk about it. It sucked. Uh, luckily, there was no fucking slip cover that came with it. So it wasn't like $23.99 or something like that. It was just 20 bucks. They didn't upcharge me for some bullshit I didn't want. For some card. However, money. yeah. However, I did go to Best Buy at one o'clock in the fucking afternoon looking for this thing, and it wasn't even on the shelf yet. I had to ask for it and then wait 15 minutes standing around like a dickhead while they dug around. Oh, yeah, this just came out today. Yes, what I fucking told you. I figured you wouldn't have it out because who else is buying fucking movies? At Best Buy. What yeah. fucking possessed you to go to Best Buy of all places? Because Walmart doesn't put them out until like 10 o'clock that fucking night. Mm. So I was just like, well, Best Buy, they always have the fucking shit out. That's what they do. They get the new shit and they put it out. Nope, fuck you. It's like should they're fucking... City. I should have just ordered it off of Amazon, but every time I checked, it said it was going to arrive like a week later. And then the night before, I'm just like, yeah, let me just check just in case, see if it'll deliver tomorrow. <laughs> and then said, oh, no, it'll be delivered the day after tomorrow. And I was like, well, fuck you. That means a snowstorm's coming and the fucking Statue of Liberty's going to get molested again. So I'm just going to head on over to Best Buy and 
have to ask two separate salespeople to go in the back and get me this fucking thing that I already looked it up. Don't it says you have three in stock. There's no reason for you to look the shit up. I already did, but of course they fucking look it up just to make sure the big fat guy isn't full of shit. Oh yeah, we got it. <laughs> so they go back and look at it. It fuck it's a mess. It's a fucking mess. And all the stores only had three, so you know they're not selling shit. If like the big release of the week, each store's just getting three, it's done. Yeah, like it's fucking done. Blu-rays, DVDs, unless you're gonna pay seventy-five dollars for some bullshit cardboard and a movie you only kind of like, DVDs and Blu-rays are fucking done. Fuck you. Get a chip implanted in your fucking head and stick a rocket up your ass and go to the fucking moon because fuck everything. Movies good. Blu-ray fucking sucks. Wait until Target has like their uh, fucking two where you buy fucking three movies. You get one of them free or wait a month. Someone's going to turn it into a used DVD store. You'll get it for 10 bucks or yep. wait a month and get it off red box used for fucking five bucks. Sure. You won't get the case, but who gives a fuck? <laughs> who gives a fuck? People who put this out didn't. Who is it? Searchlight, so I guess that's fucking Disney now. Fuck them. 